And this is close to home for many Sacramentans who have family in Israel. ABC 10's Jeannie Newen shares with us a one man's fear about his pregnant daughter's safety during the attacks and how he plans on helping all the way from Northern California. Shock, um, very grave concern. For all the people of Israel. As the death toll rises in Israel, Barry Broad says he feels helpless here in Sacramento because he has precious cargo in the midst of the danger. My daughter lives in Israel where she's lived for about 10 years. Um, she's in the latter stages of pregnancy. She's in the third trimester of pregnancy. Fearing for her unborn baby's safety, Broad says his daughter managed to get somewhere safe for now, but the danger is far from over for their family. Her husband my son-in-law um, was called up in the reserves and is fighting in southern Israel. Other than constant communication with his daughter and monitoring the attacks in Israel, Broad says he feels helpless. It's a feeling of kind of re restlessness. How can I help? As the president of the Jewish Federation of Sacramento, Broad met with other members of the organization today to plan upcoming events to help send resources to Israel. On top of that, the group recently went to Ashkelon to help with a project they didn't realize would come in handy this soon. Our community raised money to buy two bomb shelters for Ashkelon, and thank God they're there. And as Broad continues to monitor what is happening, he's hoping others will try to lift up one another during this time. There is power in, in, in prayer and power and being together. Governor Newsom's office is responding to the attack, saying California condemns the attacks by Hamas terrorists. They announced the Capitol will be lit in blue tomorrow night in support of Israel.